Hey everybody, uh, so I just did the unboxing video on the new Logitech uh, Pro Wireless uh, mouse. Um, right here. So I plugged everything in, um, got everything working, and then noticed I was like, well, let's see if the Logitech gaming software works. Uh, it doesn't look like it works. Uh, I can't change DPI settings on it or anything. So um, they give you this pamphlet, uh, and it tells you to go to this website. So let me go ahead and bring up my, uh, my browser here, and I'll show you. So it tells you go to www.logitech.com support pro wireless. And you go there and oh, nothing. Pro wireless. Oh, nothing. Gives you some how to's, gives you some information, no information on what software to use. So luckily, help the Googles searched for uh, Logitech Pro Wireless Software, and it brings you to Pro Support Downloads, which brings you back to here, which doesn't do you any good. Um, if you go down here, it brings you here. Now I can't even find, so I, I somehow got here, which this is the uh, support for pro gaming downloads mouse. So it says here Logitech gaming software. So it looks like you need a new Logitech gaming software to support pro wireless mouse, which is which is fine. So download it, install it. Um, it looks good. It looks just like the interface for the 502 um, as well. Um, same same basic configuration. Um, uh, you can set up the mouse uh, DPI uh, DPI to change DPI. You click a little, little button at the bottom. And if you notice on my screen there, you have a little thing that says switch between 800 and uh, 3600. Actually, it's supposed to be 800, not 850. So I'm just going to name this uh, profile Fortnite. And switch me back here. Um, you get two buttons on the side. You get forward and back. Um, and then the other two buttons you can use. They're kind of probably hard to use if you're right-handed. This is like an ambidextrous mouse. mouse. Um, <clears throat> so yeah, this is certainly fine using it on the left side, but using the ones on the right, yeah, probably not going to work well. Um, they just give you blank spots to put them in there now. Uh, looks like there is some RGB lighting. Um, I'm going to go ahead and turn this off. Uh, DPI. I don't know what the difference DPI. Oh, just a two light lighting. Yeah, so I can do that. It just tells you um, on the mouse there which DPI setting you're on. Two for 3600, one for 800. So I'll leave that on. Um, you can do color, color, color cycling. Uh, it gives you um, how much battery you got life. But left my setting. Uh, we're going to do. Yeah, that's my saying that's fine. Um, power, power consumption. And I guess it does, you do heat map as well. So it looks like if you do have a wireless pro gaming mouse uh, that you just got, download the new software and then you'll be able to see it and, and set the settings up. So, all right, folks, uh, have a good day.